it's the will o wisps again. We've got candy. A will o the wisp is the soul of a dead child. What do children like? You carefully place some of the candy on the ground. And we happen to have this flask. You capture a few of the will o wisps in a flask. Okay, now I believe it would show this. When you bring the willow wisp near the standing stone, glowing runes appear around a six pointed image. In the center of the runes, you can now see a small hole in the stone. And this. When you touch the dark one sign to its image on the squid stone, the sign locks into place in the small hole. The points of the sign seem to point to six of the glowing runes. A. V. O. O. Z. L. As you complete the name of the Dark One, you feel a distant rumble under the earth as of the earth shifting, or some unimaginably huge creature stirring in its sleep. Part of the squid stone opens to reveal a small compartment. You reach in to find a scroll covered with mysterious runes. The symbol of the senses at the top is the only part that you can make out. You also retrieve the dark one sign which pulls loose from the stone with a slurping, sucking sensation. The hole in the stone closes as you remove the sign. And because we're not jerks, we're going to free them. You release the willow wisps back into the swamp. Because otherwise they scream and die when daybreak hits. Great batters. Damn it. Ah! Bastard! Eat it! Ah! I figure you guys want to see this too, so why not? When you rest while poisoned, this happens. After some rest, you feel worse. Now you can either rest it away or you can use a poison cure potion, which unfortunately I have to do because I'm a dumbass. The only effect is a tingling sensation. But if Dr. Cranium is to be trusted, you should now be safe from poison for a while. Now really quickly, I want to burn all of my jumping. And let's see, it is day three. What's my character looking like? Raw, <laughs> raw meat. Okay. Spoiler. It is good to see you again. I hope you are enjoying your visit to Mordavia. You need to take better care of yourself, you know? It is very dangerous out at night. <gasps> Why, you've been injured! Here, take this and drink it. It should help. I would be most displeased. I, I mean, sorry if something were to happen to you. Come to me. I have something to show you. I warned you it is dangerous here at night and you do not listen. I intend to teach you a lesson. A strange feeling sweeps your body. You realize that you now know the frostbite spell. Perhaps that will help keep you alive when I am not with you. Okay. 
She just taught us one of the best spells that we could ever have. We now have fire, lightning, ice, and physical for spells. And the best part about frostbite is that it cuts through reversal. It's an area of effect spell, so even if you're up against Adavis and he decides to do that reversal crap, BAM! Hit him with it. He won't be able to stop it. I bid you welcome to Mordavia. I hope you are enjoying your stay here. There. Now you have had an official welcome from your own official welcome room. And tell her your name and a little about your adventures. How fascinating. I have never met a true hero before. You must tell me more sometime. You try out a few of your best lines on her. Yes. <laughs> you flatter me. It is nice to have someone as handsome, attractive as you say such things to me. Yeah, I really don't want to say goodbye just yet. Now here's the thing with Katrina. You can only ask her three things. A grand total of three things. The second you ask her three things, she's going to walk away. So I'm only going to care about the three things I care about. Magic is very useful for survival in Mordavia. Use it wisely and carefully. You wish to see me again then? Oh, perhaps we can meet again here sometime. I hope so. I live in the castle north of town. It is a cold, dreary place, I know. Try to ask about anything else right now, and she'll walk off. Right, like right now. I I must go now. I hope we can meet again soon. I enjoy your company. Before you can think to follow her, the young peasant girl has disappeared into the forest. You deftly slip over the gate and into town. but you're not quite sure if you heard the punchline yet. What did you think of my performance? Was I hilarious or what? Is this an end or a cemetery? I've had livelier times at funerals. Some help you were. Couldn't you at least have smiled a little louder? It's nights like these that make me feel like an inept idiot and a lousy laughing stock. 
I'd make more money digging graves. But why? And get out of show business. No, not you. Be they ever so humble, there's nobody stays home. I've been on the road so long, I have flat tires on my feet. I go wherever I can tell a good joke, and many places where I can't. I'm staying at this inn for a while until I find something here. I got the last door down the hall. Visit me sometime. I'm sure we can have a few laughs together. Hey, my last tour was a great success. I outran everyone. But there's no business like show business. With me, the show must go on and on and on. I got millions of them. Problem is, I can't remember most of them, and the ones I do remember should have been buried long ago. I used to be worth my wit in gold, but oh, it's a long story. Ask me about it some other time. Let's go back up. You unlock the...